All right, this one's uh, a video for uh, some guys who have asked for the Decider head unit uh, kind of settings and functions and whatnot. So here you can see I'm just playing a little game. Obviously, I don't play while I'm driving and the game plays automatically. This is my character. It's a game I play for many years now. And we have an auto battle function uh, which allows me to uh, leave the game on its own and it will go and do whatever it needs to do. But that's not what we're here for. So what I want to show you is that settings that I wanted to, uh, I was talking about the other day. So if you go to your main menu and uh, go to setting, um, on the settings section, what you will see is we have uh, a section where it says car. Right, you've got a car settings here. Now, here, what I would recommend is uh, there was one person who was having some issue where his audio wasn't working. Um, my advice to you is disconnect everything. Like if you got if you've connected Bluetooth, disable that. Like you know, forget the network, forget everything. Right, and go back to factory setting, and then you know, um, reset the whole device. Now, the factory setting is one two six. They all have this same code. It's one two six. So go to one two six. Um, once you're in there. You want to go to Canvas, all right, and you want to set up whichever model um, works with you. For example, here you've seen I've used the swap function, so you can see I've used the swap, right? Now, I had to swap this because my front door, when I open it, like now, um, was showing the opposite thing. So when I swapped it, it became the right way. That's why you would swap it. So anything here that you have that is not uh, adjusting correctly, just swap it. Um, obviously, these are very important. Now, key mode, um, just use number one, as I found that to be one of the best. Um, all others, you, can, you know, it depends if you've got an amplifier, you can boost it up. It will pump the amplifier as well. I don't have an amplifier and I don't really use an amplifier, so I'm not that fussed. Um, type remember type zero is very important now rudder is basically which side your steering wheel is so i'm on the right so i've got it on the right rudder and then uh this is on the simple version so i've got other versions if you look at this i can you know there are plenty of other uh, outlanders and all sorts right but i prefer to leave it on the single it works for me normally if you've bought the uh the unit for your car specific for your car they would give you all of this set up already however if you haven't then manually you can do this stuff right now if you have uh, audio issues, my advice is pump these all up. So on the voice section, um, just pump it all up. Um, it goes all the way up to 20. I found, um, for example, I'll show you, look, it goes to 20. For me, I found 15 is a, a, a good level, um, you know, that I, I kind of pr I prefer basically. So I leave it on 15 anyway. So that's that. Of course, if you have any issues, you want to, you know, f fix your keys, then you can fix it here. Now, a section here on other um not much here to do basically other than like your rgb and this and that whatever right but here there is a section where you have your boot default volume so if you look carefully it says boot default volume that has to be turned up all the way right so or, or whatever desired i've got it on eight eight for me is quite good so i've just left it there um so other than that that's it once you've done that apply all right, once you're on the apply and then press exit, and when you do that, it will basically um, reboot the whole device, add the settings on for you. So that's that. Now, also, if you, um, I mean, the other thing I would recommend is, for example, going to systems and reset the whole device, right? So here you can reset your network and XYZ or erase everything, go back to factory. My recommendation is go back to factory. Um, sometimes it will clear up any errors and hopefully you can get all your uh, stuff working there. Now, the one thing I'm not going to activate today and it happened last time as well. So as soon as I activate the Android Auto, you notice basically the whole video disconnects. I mean, I could do this right now and if it does disconnect, I'll just re-record again. Um, and hopefully that will kind of show you what's going on. So um, let's go to, let's do this, right? So this is Android Auto activating and I'm sure it's going to disconnect as soon as I um, activate it. Let's see what happens. Um, so what Android Auto is doing basically, so it's just connected, obviously disconnected for a second. I had to re-record this. What it does is automatically um, switches off the Wi-Fi. So you can see it switches off the Wi-Fi, activates the um, built-in hotspot and then it comes up right so once it's there you've got your Android Auto depends how you've set yours up so this is how I've set mine up obviously I've done a few hacks in big note uh, this and that whatever here um, 
but other than that you can see you know if i if i wanted to go into the map um it's there of course any map i activate on my phone so if i'm searching something it automatically shows up to it as long as i'm connected um there are a few other apps that i've put in this is kind of a hack so this stuff you have to do on your phone so this is a, a app called car tube you have to put it on your phone um in order for it to show up so there's nothing there's no function for you to activate this here um it's uh, kind of a little hack uh, that you can get on github so download the apk from github and then you've got yourself youtube for example so if i was to play this for example you would see that it starts playing um and it's pretty good it's pretty stable has no issues um obviously volume controls and everything work it's a bit sluggish right now because i'm using the phone to do other stuff but that's how it is so um you shouldn't have any issues remember if you do just factory reset everything right if you factory reset everything you wouldn't have any issues at all um and yeah you can continue doing whatever you do so uh, for example uh now that i've you'll notice that it won't connect to the game right because remember there's no uh it's doing its own hotspot so i need to go back here rem um, activate my um my wireless for it to start working so reconnect to server hold on let's try and see if, if the wi-fi connects right so as soon as the wi-fi will connect it will reconnect to the server so let's try and see what happens here saying that um, on my device my hotspot could be off no that's fine so i could reconnect now so i'm reconnected and as you can see the game starts playing back again um pretty cool stuff um just thought i'd do a nice little update here and obviously the person who's having some volume issue now the one other thing i could say to you is if all of this fails and uh, you know you've got a situation where the audio still doesn't come my advice to you is your device is faulty get that returned to them because normally that's not an issue i have had a similar issue where my audio wasn't great or um the bluetooth for example when i was streaming it was lagging a little bit like so it it the the like people when they talk or something on youtube or something their mouths are moving but nothing's happening right and it happens later so i i did have a lag and this and that i just factory reset everything and then just went through the stages again and because i i got mine specifically for this device the um the what do you call this the canvas was already set up for this um so i'll probably i just got a bit lucky also one other thing i got lucky with as well um is you know i've got wireless um apple carplay um which which is really really cool and then obviously i've got android carplay as well and now my uh, it works on wireless as well so i'm really happy with all of those um but yeah i mean I've, just minor stuff also what i what i'm going to say to you is look this thing has a built-in mic so if you do get a separate mic like me i've got a mic here i recommend don't use this i did connect it it's rubbish i'm not using it also you probably notice i've got a usb thing here that's actually the usb uh ports that come from here i've just extended it and put it onto a thing so i can connect via usb if i wanted to um however i've noticed this these usb the the ones that come with this unit um they're not powerful enough so for example i've got a samsung note and instead of charging my phone it actually drains it which is kind of stupid so i i just use a pd charger as you can see here i've just got a pd charger uh belkin pd charger they're really really good um so yeah they you know supercharge fast charging i, I really like it very short time I, 10 15 minutes i get like 50 percent. so i'm really happy with that um but yeah other than that i hope this kind of helps and uh yes i do not play games while i'm driving and as you can see as you've witnessed here i physically do not touch the game the game does whatever it needs to do i don't have to um unless i want to go into something or collect something or whatever right so got some achievements whatever it is so yeah i mean other than that i don't have to the game itself has been designed so it works automatically um pretty cool feature i love this game been playing it for years um since 2015 or 16 i can't remember but it's a very long time i've been playing this game um so yeah i'm not promoting the game <laughs> other than that like share subscribe guys i'm gonna catch you on another one very soon adios my amigos